No. There we go. All right, we're going to start that warm up. Pace yourself. Adjust the weights as we go along if you need. All right. Let's take some music in here. Starting with the march, pumping the arms at your sides. Just get them nice and tall. Put the alternating heels to the front with the bicep curl. Keep it going. Right, left. I'll give you just a little kick and we're going to punch to the front, keeping that kick low. We're going to alternate our knees and just pull. Double the knee. One more time. Now tap that in step, right up. Side of the heel. Now hamstring curl, reach and pull. We're going to angle to the left, back hand, front knee. Stay there, repeat the knee. Four more. Now face front, alternate hand, left, right. Angle to the right, back hand, front knee. Stay there, repeat the knee. Four more. Face the front, alternate hand, right, left. Okay, just plant those feet and just squat. Take it down, up. Okay, right leg lunges back. Four, three, two. Right back to your squat. Push those hips back, keep that chest tall. This time, left leg lunges back. Back to that squat. Step out with that right foot, go side to side. Four presses right. How many singles? Four presses left. And give me singles. We're going to keep those singles. Bring that body center, little press, straight down. We're going to keep that press. We're going to bring our arms in the middle pose. Okay, we're going to turn that upper body only. Take it right and center and left and center. One more time. Now tap that foot and reach. Right, left. Take that single arm, circle it in. Give me a big circle here. Now lean with the back of the hand, bring it around the front. Swing both arms. Side stepping in. Take it to a march to shake out those arms. Roll the shoulders back a couple times. Okay, I'm going to work one muscle group at a time. Two exercises. I'm going to try and go through them two times, all right? Anywhere from 12 to 8 reps. We'll start out on the floor. So you're going to grab your mat. We're going to do push ups. Then we're going to roll over and we're going to work the chest on the floor. All right, so whatever you need for a chest press, out beside you. 
We'll start out with the push-ups. Coming down on knees or toes. If you're on the knee, top of the knee cap. All right, hands underneath those shoulders, weight over the hands. We're gonna do a single count for four. Here we go. Give me four, three, two. Take it down and just pulse. Eight. Give me four, three, two, down and up. Take it down, up. Two more. Take it halfway down and pulse. Eight. Give me four, three, two, single count. Take it down, up. Bend those elbows to lower. Down and pulse, here we go. Eight. Give me four, three, two, down and up. Take it down, up. Chest to the floor. Last time pulsing. Eight. Give me four, three, two, and one. Come up, sit back on your heels for a sec. Little stretch. Roll over, grab your weights. Coming down to the floor. Chest press. Back of the arms against the floor. Palms facing back. Four singles and a pulse for eight. Here we go. So take it four, three, two. Halfway up and just pulse. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and press. Pressing up and down. Two, three, four. Take it halfway up and pulse. Eight, four, three, two. Pressing up. Take it up and down. Two, three, halfway up and pulse. Give me eight. Four, three, two, last time press for four, three, three, two, one, halfway up the pulse, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Bring those weights down, set them on the floor, grab behind one knee, roll up, come over to your front again. Back to those push-ups. Hands under the shoulders, toes and knees, single count. We got four, three, two, one, down and pulse, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, single count, take it down, up, breathe. Down and pulse. Four, three, two, single count, take it down, up, Woo! down with your pulse, eight, there's four, three, two, last time singles, four, you got this, three, two, down with your pulse, here we go. Give me four, three, two, and one. Let's sit back, little stretch. Oh my. Coming in, coming over onto your back. You need to adjust your waist, adjust. Go into that chest press. Two dumbbells down on your back. Palms facing back. Singles for four. Give me four. Three, two, and one. Up and pulse. Eight. Give me four, three, two. Right into singles for four, three, two. Now we pulse. Eight. Three, four, three, two, and press up, up. 
it down. Woo. Up and pause. Eight. Two, four, three, two, last time singles. Four, three, two, and pause. Eight. Give me four, three, two, and one. Bring those weights down. Good job. All right, we're gonna roll up. Shake out those arms, that chest. We're gonna stay on the floor. We're gonna work the triceps. How are we doing? Yeah, that was a little something, wasn't it? All right, we're gonna do Kate Small Pressure. So you're gonna need two dumbbells. Coming in, jump in. Dumbbell heads down to the chest. So you're gonna need two dumbbells. Working the upper back part of the arm. Roll down to your back. Get those arms above the chest. Palms facing back. You're going to bend at the elbow. Upper arm stays still. Two-two each way. Dumbbell head to the chest. Here we go. Take it down for two. Up for two. Down. Up. Remember, upper arm does not move. Down for two. Up for two. Down. Down, up, up. Bend the elbow. Take it down, up, down, up. Give me two more. Down, up, and down, and up. Good job. Bring those weights down to the floor. Roll to your front. Still working the triceps. All the way down on the floor. Hands by the shoulders. One of the hand against the floor. The rest of your hand is lifted. Your fingers are off the floor. You're going to push to the butt of your hand. We're going to do a pace of one, two, three, one. Follow my pace. I'll vary the speed. Working that tricep. Ready? Here we go. Let's take it. One, two, three, one. One, two, three, two. Push to the butt of the hand. Up, two, three, four. Up, two, three, six. One, two, three, seven. One, two, three, eight. One, two, three, nine. One, two, three, ten. One. Three, eleven, one, two, three, twelve, one, two, three, thirteen, one, two, three, fourteen, one, two, three, fifteen, two, three, sixteen, one, two, three, seventeen, one, two, three, eighteen, one, two, three. 19, 1, 2, 3, 1. Woo. On your back. What is she doing? Okay, grab those dumbbells again. Stay small pressure. Still working that tricep. Arms in the up position. Palms facing back. Upper arm is still. Two, two, down. Here we go. Take it down for two. Up for two. Down, upper back part of the arm. Down, down, up, up. Give me four. Up, up, and five. Up, up, six. Down to the center of the chest. Back up with control. Seven. There's eight. Two more. Control it. Last one. Good job. Bring those weights down. Place them on the floor. Coming over to your front. You gotta love this, right? All the way down. Now remember, just the butt of a hand on the floor. When you come up, you push through the butt of a hand. Here we go. So one, two, 
knees and hold. Two, three, two more. Pull, half, pull, release, pulse. Use your back, come on. Pull, half, pull and release and pulse. Two, three, and release. Take that tube off, put it off to the side. Grab your weight or weights. Roll down to your back. Bring those weights above the chest. Soft elbows, down halfway, ready, here we go, so take it down, half, down, all the way up. Again, focusing on back, lower your lats this time, and pull up, all the way back, halfway, bring it down, contract and lift back up, down, half, down, up. Down, half, down, up. Down, half, down, up. Let's do two more. Take it back. Half, down, and up. Go back. Half, down, and up. Bring the weight to your left. Roll yourself up. Grabbing that two. Divide it in half, place the tube on the top part of your shoelaces, top part of the foot, wrap it around that foot, bring it up inside. All right, make sure it's close to your ankle. Sit up nice and tall, legs long in front, halfway, so pull, half, pull, and release. Now pulse three, two, one, relax. Pull, half, pull, and release. Pulse, two, three, and release. Now use your back to do the row, all right? And pulse, two, three, and release. Pulse, half, pull, and release. Pulse, shoulder blades squeezing together. Squeeze, squeeze, and release. Now squeeze, 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 and release. Pull, try to keep your arms relaxed. Pulse, two, three, and release. We pull, pull, and release. Pulse. Good job. Pull, half, half, and release. Pulse. We just sit her back. And pulse. We're going to do one more. Pull, release, pull, and release. Pulse, two, three, and down. Good job, take that tube off. Keep the hands above the knees or on the bench. Press the standing. How we doing? Hello? Yeah? All right, now, shoulders, two dumbbells. All right, let's see. I'm gonna have to go right on the standing. So we're going to start with upright rows, up halfway, and a pulse three. So two weights that you can do with that lift. Open the trapezius, your shoulder, palms facing in, and your elbows. Here we go. So it's up, half, up, and down. Up, half, up, and down. Contract, and release. Up, half, up, down. You're keeping the weights close to the body. You're leading up with those elbows. Using the trapezius and upper shoulder. Breathe. Two more. Last one. Control the up. Control that down. Good job. Okay, now we're going to go to an iron cross. Two dumbbells. All right? Palms facing down. You're going to have the shoulder. You're going to open. You're going to close. And you're going to lower. Your shoulder. Open. Close. And lower. Again, keep the elbow soft. Close. And lower. Four. Open. Close. And lower. 
Anything down those weights can be done without. Always remember that. Six. Open. Close. Lower. Seven. Open. Close. One more. Control it. Good job. All right. Let's go back to those upright rows. Shake off the arms a little bit if you need. Adjust the weight as you need. Up halfway, knees with those elbows. Here we go. Up, half, up, and down. Breathing. Up, half, up, down. There's four. Five. Six. Seven. One more. And eight. Good job. All right. Go on to that iron cross. Take out those arms if you need to. Okay, palms facing you. The shoulders open, close, and lower. Keeping that elbow slightly bent. Don't lock it out. Lift, open, close, and lower. Breathe. Try not to stretch up through the neck. Six. We got two more. Yeah, all right, get those weights down. Grab a drink if you need. We're going to move on to the biceps. Starting with two dumbbells. All right, palms facing forward. In front of the body. We're going to go halfway up. We're going to go to the navel and then lower. Then we'll do the top half. Then we'll do the full range. Maybe twist. Go up to the navel. Go down. There's two. Go down. Use your bicep. Three. Control it. Four. Five. Go halfway up. Six. There's seven. And here's eight. Now this time you're going to come all the way up to the shoulders and come down to the chest. Top half. Three. Keep those elbows close to your sides. Four. Use that bicep to lift that weight. Five. Six. Seven. And eight. Come all the way down. Let's do four eight. All the way up. All the way down. Elbows close to your sides. Control that up. Definitely control that down. Here's number four. Here's number five. Here's number six. Number seven. And number eight. Yes, good job. Okay, second exercise. We're going to use the two. And you stand on with two feet. If you want more intensity, bring your feet apart. All right? We're going to start with your palms up. We're going to alternate right and left. Regular tempo. And then we'll up the tempo, shorten your range of motion. And go a little faster, okay? We'll go back and forth. So you got right. Just do both of them. You got right and down. Up and down. Both arms, get in, use your biceps. up. Keep that wrist rigid, don't let it bend. Number six, give me two more, control it down. Pull that down. Okay, now we're gonna shorten the range of motion and up the tempo. Alternate, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, one. 
two, both arms slow down, up and down. Four inch. Breathe. Go both ways. Two more. Get ready to alternate. Up that tempo. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Back to single. Both arms up and down. Breathe. Two. You can take one foot off to make a less intense. Less resistance. Take one foot off if you need that. Two more. You got this. One more. Alternate. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and eight, seven, six, five, four. Three, two, and one. Come on. Woo! Set two down. Grab your weights. Roll back to that half. Bottom half, top half. Four range. All facing forward. Bottom half. So you got one, two, three, four. Breathe. Seven. Eight. Now you're going all the way up. Come down to your chest. Elbows close to your sides. Three. Four. Five. Can you feel your biceps? Six. Yes. Seven. Eight. All the way down. Full range. Control both ways. Number six. 
Two more sets. And eight. Good job. Okay, we're gonna go to one dumbbell. We're gonna go right into a curtsy, right into a side squat. Staying on the right side. Hold the dumbbell at chest height. Start on the right side and stay on the right. And then curtsy. Squat out to the right. Curtsy squat. Side squat. You gotta get that knee. Curtsy. Side squat. Five. Six. Seven. And eight. Good job. Switching to the other side. Curtsy back left. Side squat left. I want to squat both ways. You gotta bend that knee and get down there. Three. Do not rush it. Four. Keep that chest up. Five. Six. Seven. And eight. Yes, good job. Grab your partner dumbbell, get that into a squat. Feet your shoulder. And you could get this. So you go down, come up, step back, and up. It's a deadlift. It's a squat. It's a deadlift. It's a squat. Number four. Control it. Number five. Breathe. Number six. Seven. And eight. Yes. Last exercise, one dumbbell. Starting on the right side, curtsy to your squat. Here we go, so you curtsy. Side squat. Don't turn your body on that curtsy. Keep your hips facing front. Curtsy, side squat. Nice and control. Two more. Good job. Move down. Point to that left side to finish. Here we go. To curtsy to a side squat. So you squat on the curtsy and you squat on the side. Four, five, focus in, six, seven, and eight. Yes, good job, you're done. Way to go. Let's pull down. Just sit in a seat on the floor on that mat. Legs long in front of you. Good job, everybody. Okay, you're sitting up nice and tall, go slow in front. Take a deep breath up. You're gonna lift your ribs. Hinge and exhale forward, coming down to toes, ankles, calves, whatever you can reach. Hold there and breathe. Release, sit back up. Give me a deep breath up. Lift those ribs, hinge and exhale, down the hole. Release. Right leg in front left. Pull them in. This hinge forward and hold. Push up. Let's switch those legs out. Again, hinge forward and hold. Swing those legs behind you. Come over onto your hands and knees. Bring your knees 
about shoulder distance underneath those hips, hands under the shoulders. Push your hips back, putting that seat right onto your heels. Upper body comes down towards the floor or your thighs. Child's pose. Okay, now with your hands, pull your body forward, drag your hips to the floor. Upper body stays lifted. Shoulders away from the ears. Breathe. Make sure your feet are shoulder distance. Tuck your toes under. We're going to push up to the hips and show downward dog. Again, upper body comes towards the thighs. Hold there. Try to drag those heels down as much as you can. Breathing. Suck them over those knees. Walk your hands in towards your feet. Stay hung over. Keep the upper body totally relaxed. Head, neck. Shoulders, arms, totally relaxed. Knees are soft. Soften the knees a little more and slowly roll up. One vertebrae at a time. Roll those shoulders back. Step down. Arms relaxed. Put your feet about shoulder distance. Put your right hand back between your shoulder blades. Grab that right elbow. Pull it in and down towards your head. As you look forward, stretching that tricep, step out with that left foot, side hand to your left, take the right elbow, drive it to the left corner of your room, bring that elbow back, bring your body center, and switch those arms, and grab that left elbow, you're going to pull it in and down towards your head. Looking straight ahead. Press in to the right. Elbow to the right corner of the room. Bring that elbow back. Bring your body center. Right arm comes down, left arm halfway. Bring it around the front. Grab above your elbow. Pull in and down to your chest as close as you can get it. Keep that shoulder relaxed and go to your left. And now that right hand pulling the left arm towards the right a little more. Okay, look center. Release that arm. Let's shake it out a little bit. Roll that shoulder down. Okay, right arm comes across. Grab it with the elbow. Pull in and down. Shoulders relaxed. Look to the right. Okay, look center. Release, shake it out, roll that shoulder. Okay, just bring those hands onto our glutes. Put the elbows together as close as you can. Stretch up the chest. Relax. Let's try that one more time. Pull the elbows together. Chest is tall. Keep breathing. And relax. Take a deep breath up. Exhale down. One more time. Inhale up. Good job. Way to go. All right. We're going to go to core. If you're staying, grab your mat. We'll come down to the floor. If you're leaving, thank you. Try to stay dry out there. Sugar melts now. Remember what I told you. Be careful in that rain. Yeah. Okay. We're going to come down to the floor. We're going to work the upper abdominal. The area above your navel. So your focus is on that. Here we can find the ears. Lower back resting against the floor. Ready? Here we go. Contract and lift and lower. Now I want you coming all the way up. And all the way back down. I want you to breathe. Pull that navel in. Press it right up against that spine as you exhale out. Use that core to lift with, alright? There's four. And three. There's two. 
Okay, you're gonna do a two two count. Here we go. Okay, up for two and down for two. All the way up, all the way down. Control, both ways. You exhale, you inhale. One more. Up, back to singles, up and down. All the way up and stay lifted. All the way up. Hold right there. Okay, now pulse right here. Little pulses. On each pulse, you're contracting that upper abdominal. Little pulses. Let's go. Eight, seven. Contract those abs. Give me four, three, two. We're going to go down and up. Take it down. All the way up, down, all the way up. Take another pulse right here. Lift, lift. Contract those abs. Eight more. Give me four, three, two. Down, up, take it down. All the way up. Breathe. Take it up the pulse, let's go. Use that upper core. Eight more. Give me four, three, two, down, up, and go. Down, up, down, up. Up the pulse, right here. All the way up. Take it up and hold. All the way up and hold. Have this tight. Keep breathing. Now four times down, slow. Take it down. Two, three, four. With your left heel by the hip, follow with your right. Tell me to tilt. Tilt those hips and release. Okay, now you're going to the lower portion of the core. Below the navel. Contract those muscles real tight. Pull them in. Press that navel right up against that spine. Bringing you right into that little pelvic tilt. All right? So use your tilt by using the core. Don't rock the body. Try to keep the lower back relaxed. Pull it in and release. Exhale. Exhale. Good. Okay, now, going to that pelvic tilt, pulse, little pulse, and here again, each pulse you have a contraction of that lower abdominal, so use the core, give me eight more, give me four, three, two back to singles, Contract, release, nice and strong. Pull it in. Breathe. We got four more. We'll put it all together. Full body crunch. Two more. Okay, knees to chest center. Knees to the center. Really pull them in. Bring that chest up. Pull those knees in. Squeeze. Navel to the spine. Exhale. Then you eight more. Eight. Seven. Breathe. Elbows out to the side. Four more. Three. Two. And one. As the body comes down, keep those knees and tabletop arms above the chest. Reach the ceiling. Both arms, both legs. Extend out. Two counts. 
Take it out for two. Straight hand for two. Now on four extension out. Stand in. Do not rush. In. In. Now that lower back's coming off the floor. Pick those legs up a little higher. Full extension out. Bring your hand. I want you to flex those feet when you go out. Reach for that other wall with those fingertips. In. In. Take it out. Out. In. In. Okay, now take it out and just hold. Just hold. For four and three and two, pull it in. Good job. All right. Now bind the knees, pull it into the chest. Pull the head a couple times, right to left. Bring one foot to the floor, another foot. Just take your legs long. Bring your hands underneath your bottom. We're going to do scissor feet and open close legs. All right. Take a deep breath. Exhale. Lift. Scissor one, two. Three, four, five, six, seven. Feet come together. Then you're going to open and close those legs. You're going to bring your shoulders down on the open close. Okay, now lift your shoulders back to the center. I want you to be straight up to the ceiling, not your feet. Five, six, seven. Feet together. Now you open and close. Open and close. Back to your scissor. Here we go. One, two, lift those shoulders if you can. Five, six, seven, feet together. You got to open close. One more time. Lift your shoulders, scissor. Go straight up. Five, six, seven, feet together. You got to open and close. Two more. Good job. Bring it down. Bring your feet to the floor. Take them out wide. Bring it just behind those ears. Roll up. Just take it up and down. Again, I want full range of motion. I want you coming all the way up using that upper abdominal. Hold on. Contract and roll up. Good job. We're going to move to the oblique area, the waistline. Take it your right shoulder to your left knee. You're going to cross all the way over and all the way back. Leave with the shoulder. Twist from the torso. Use that oblique. Get it over there. Two more. You're going to that right arm. Keep your finger and go tap the outside of that knee, not the top of it, the outside. Again, bring that arm all the way back. So push it from that torso. Four more. Let's go. Give me four. Three. Two. Now let's try to reach through that calf. I think you can. Come on. Go further. Bring that arm back. Four more. Give me four. And three. There's two. Now you're going to roll up in the center, upper abdominal, call on it, use it, feel it. Four more, contract and roll up, full range. Keep breathing. Okay, left shoulder, right knee. Go over and back. Keep that elbow out to the side. All the way over, all the way back. Up and down. A 
deep breath. As you exhale, let the body totally relax. Bring your arms to your side, roll to your front. Elbows on the floor, hands on the floor in front of you, chin to your chest. Push against the floor, lift just that upper body. Keep the chin on the chest, hold and breathe. Now slowly lift your head up. Look forward, hold. Chin back to the chest. Up on your hands and knees, knees under those hips, hands under your shoulders. Tuck your tailbone under, arms the back up high, lift your head drop down. Coming to neutral spine, hold. This time, tailbone and chin, tilt up and hold. Keep breathing. And come to neutral, hold. All the way up on those knees, bring one foot in front, tuck your back toe under, and press to standing. Good job, everybody, thank you. See you next week.